Looking at data, one can see that in areas where there is lots of rain, there will be even more rain, possibly causing floods, drowning of crops and soil erosion. However, there is already little rain, such as some parts of the USA where farmers are struggling to grow crops. It looks like there will be even less rain, causing droughts, crops dying and land becoming unfarmable. So one can say that the global trend is that it will get more extreme on both ends. The main cause for overall increase in rainfall globally is because of increased greenhouse gas emissions. The gases that people all over the world release lead to the increasing temperatures. This in result leads to melting ice caps and rising sea levels. And because the sea levels are rising, there is more water being evaporated and later precipitated. Despite the fact that there is more rainfall in many places, there are still several areas for example, sub-Saharan African countries and some parts of the USA, which lack rainfall and are suffering because of it. As a result of increasing rainfall, there will be more flooding in certain areas, flood-prone areas specifically. This will lead to damaged crops and also smaller towns, as their infrastructures may get destroyed. Floods caused by the rainfall can also flood sewers, which could spread polluted water and this could be potentially dangerous for humans. Also, increased rainfall can destroy ecosystems and could be harmful in the long term. However, there could be some benefits in the long term from increased rainfall. Areas that suffer from an abundance of rainfall, of rainfall could use it to aid areas without, and the increased rainfall could potentially help with the droughts. Implications. Child drought simply means that the farming in that area decreases and large numbers of people migrate to other areas. The American Midwest drought happens when there is an abundance of water supply to irrigate the crops sufficiently, thus leading to food shortage. Massive flooding often occurs in Asian countries where tropical monsoons batter crops to such an extent that they drown. In this case, people migrate to areas where there are not as extreme environmental impacts. Also, changes in temperatures can destroy coastlines. If the water gets too warm for fish to survive in, then coral reefs will also die as they depend on the fish. The increase in temperature can also trigger stronger and more devastating typhoons. In order to prevent droughts or floods caused by lack or abundance of rainfall, countries could create a system that harvests excess water from areas that receive too much rainfall or channel the flooding rainwater from crops and use this water to assist other areas with a lack of rainfall. Countries along the Nile, for example, could create tributaries that extend into sub-Saharan countries in order to give them a permanent and mostly reliable source of water.